You've been getting together almost 20 years now as a band? That's sort of close to say. Mm, not not to date everybody here, because I don't know when you got Maybe together. Like sweet 16 or yeah. something. What, what is it that's kept you together for so long as a band? When a lot of bands have a hard time getting through five years, let alone... I think it's because, the, because we formed this band, because we love this kind of music, and uh, when you start out that way, as opposed to starting out with no love of music because you want to have a career and, and be a success. Uh, that, that's fine too, but, but if you start out because you love music and you love to make songs, then you're a success already. All you have to do is keep doing that, you know, somehow, you know. Um, some, some of the best bands I think you'll, you'll never hear of because they're people that have jobs and they write great songs, but they never get to a place where they can make records or find a record company or something. But but they still make great songs. And, and some of the worst bands you hear are, are ones that are doing it because it's a business. And this sounds like a hit, so I wrote it yeah. that way. Yeah. We're lucky that this, the two of us can, uh, I think, we keep each other from wiping out. So. <laughs> Remember this. Everything that you have ever experienced in your entire life has brought you to this instant. All things now are possible in the limitless void of counter-actuality. All things, too, that are knowable will be realized in this new dimension of Bikini Girls with Machine Guns. some Legs serious up. fashion Legs statements up, here. Tell I'll me about the, tell me the, the fashion philosophy of the cramps. 
Look at those um, shoes. Sharp, pointy, tall. Um, these are training shoes. He's, uh, we're training him to walk in higher heels. Uh, he'll graduate to higher and higher ones. My wheels fell yeah. off. Ballet too. You shop at some very famous stores, though, don't you? Where, where do you where do you frequent? Famous stores? Yeah, like good, the best places to shop. They're you know, actually pretty obscure. Be... What are they? These are the tall girl shoe store, where he, because he's a tall girl. Um, yeah, it's usually just short men in there, but uh, it's called the tall girl shoe store. We like to buy clothes in a lot of bondage shops. And especially in England, there's a lot of great bondage shops. Yeah. Prefer rubber and plastic Skin in clothes, usually. I gotta ask about this material, because last time you came to town, I saw you were wearing it, and now you got the whole band wearing it. it yeah, what good, is it? it? Uh, what PVC. Is it? Feels good, this sounds is PVC. good. Okay. I like in, uh, is it in Germany or Holland, they call it gummy. Do you on that one? It's like like from the gummy you wear. It's a gummy. Oh, that's a good noise. And yeah, the whole band has um, gotten big now. We don't always wear this kind of stuff, though. Sometimes we wear rubber. What is it about the Cramps that, that instills such, I don't know, Well, we're a true rock and roll band, which is, which is more than just a musical group. We, we kind of uh, uh, stand for something. We represent our fans and uh, uh, say the things that we think they'd want us to say. And uh, like so it's uh, a little bit we're like we're uh, um, you know, diplomats in a foreign land or something. It's a foreign planet. Now, I understand that you guys are not too thrilled that rock and roll is turning so goody-goody these days with, let's save the environment, and, and it, I mean, that it's, it's not so much the voice of the youth, it's more like a voice of maybe establishment. Yeah. It's become respectable, and that's where the death of rock and roll is, in respectability. It should be music for misfits, it should be, um, it should be dangerous. I mean, I'm sure those causes are all good causes, but mm. that's not the place of rock and roll. The purpose of rock and roll is instant gratification. Yeah, it's like all these things, all these aid benefits and everything like that. It's like having having a knife fight for uh, for the good of humanity or something. It, just, it doesn't make sense. You mm -hmm. know, rock and roll is juvenile delinquent music. You know, or else it's not rock and roll. It's just pop music. Mm -hmm. 